पश्चिमी थिंक इट्स अ बिग तमाशा बाय द सी बी आई और प्रेजेंट गवर्नमेंट सेंट्रल गवर्नमेंट एवरी कॉल दैट द सी बी आई गेव टू हिम ही वॉज प्रेजेंट एंड प्रेजेंटेड हिम सेल्फ एंड गेव ऑल द एविडेंस दैट वॉज रिक्वायर्ड एंड इनसेंट मैन इज बींग मेड अस्केप गोट ऑल इज बींग इनसेंट मैन इज बींग डिसरिस्पेक्टली ट्रीटेड एन इनसेंट मैन इज बी मेड अ पब्लिक एग्जाम्पल for no reason at all without any proof no chief of air staff ever can decide what the indian air force requires and gets plain simple because it's not a indian air force decision it's the government of india decision i was incredulous i couldn't believe that a former chief of the air staff who had been under investigation for the last 3 or 4 years was arrested when to the best of my knowledge in whatever has come in the press in the media he has been cooperating fully the point is all the evidence is with the cbi in their lock up which evidence can he tamper with his lawyer also put it across to them with the family and everything over all over here there no chance of his getting away from the country my gut feeling tells me there is some political angle in this the decision making i would go as far as to say it is incumbent on the defense minister the home minister to say why they have allowed such an arrest to take place i know that the cbi for all uh, known purposes is an autonomous body but there are certain conditions under which the government has to exercise its control over the investigation agency it is impossible that the files went through the whole labyrinth of the ministry of defense to the prime minister's office and came back and went to the ministry of finance for financial approval and came back without anybody asking the question of air chief marshal tyagi at that time as to why he changed on his own it's very sickening and saddening very sad state of affairs in a country which he calls as democracy where the rights of the people are supposed to be preserved and sacrosanct a man who has made himself available to all the authorities at all the times that they have asked for him even on a telephonic call that he has to be put into this kind of an embarrassing situation it is very sad it impacts on the morale of the defense services not the air force alone as a disciplined officers of the armed forces for us being caught let alone being imprisoned by civilian authority is absolutely demoralizing especially when we feel when many of us feel that air chief marshal tyagi could not have done what he is alleged to have done all by himself if at all he has done it